Hello, friends, and welcome to Storytime. Today, we're going to be reading the book called Baby Goes to Market. This book is by Atanuke, and it's illustrated by Angela Brooksbank. And this is the front cover, this is the back cover, and this is the spine. You can see on the spine, it says Baby Goes to Market. You see a lot of red squares and black circles. Baby Goes to Market. This is the title page, Baby Goes to Market by Atanuke and illustrated by Angela Brooksbank. Baby goes to market with mama. There's the baby and there's mama. Market is very crowded. Baby is very curious. Baby is so curious that Mrs. Ade, the banana seller, gives baby six bananas. So she's the banana seller and she gives the baby six bananas. One, two, three, four, five, six. Baby is so surprised. Baby eats one banana. And puts five, bas five bananas in the basket because six minus one equals five. So now we have five left. One, two, three, four, five. Mama does not notice. She is busy buying rice. Market is very crowded. Baby is very hot. Baby is so hot that Mr. Femi, the orange seller, gives baby five juicy oranges. One, two, three, four, five. Baby grins. He's so excited. Baby sucks on one orange. And puts four oranges in the basket because five minus one equals four. Mama does not notice she is buying homemade palm oil. Market is very crowded. Baby is very cheerful. Baby is so cheerful that Mr. Momo, the biscuit seller, gives baby four sugary chin chin biscuits. One, two, three, four. Baby claps, baby eats one chin chin. And puts three chin chin in the basket. So there's there were four chin chin cookies, baby ate one, and now there's one, two, three, three biscuits left. Mama does not notice. She is busy buying chili peppers. So now here we have bananas and tomatoes. Well, she and oranges, cookies, rice, palm oil, lots of things in the basket. Market is very crowded. Baby is very funny. Baby is so funny that Mrs. Kunli, the sweet corn seller, gives baby three roasted sweet corn. One, two, three. Baby beams, he's so happy to get all that corn. Baby eats one toasted, roasted sweet corn. And he puts two roasted sweet corn in the basket. So we had three, he ate one, and now we have two left. So he puts two of the corn in the basket. Mama does not notice, she is busy buying flip flops. Market is very crowded. Baby is very naughty. Very naughty, pulling on all the clothes. Oh my goodness. He's pulling on all the clothes here. Baby is so sorry that Mrs. Deli, the coconut seller, gives baby two pieces of coconut. There's the coconut right here. One, two, two pieces. Baby licks his lips. Baby eats one piece of coconut. And he puts the other piece in the basket. So we had two, she gave him two pieces of coconut. He ate one and now he has one left over because two minus one equals one. Mama does not notice her basket is very heavy. Look how she's carrying it on her head. Very, very, very heavy. And mama thinks her sweet baby must be hungry by now. Taxi, mama shouts, we need to get home quick and fast. So here she is right here and she's flagging down a taxi. 
Mama puts her basket down. What is this? cries Mama. Five bananas? Four oranges? Three chinchin biscuits? Two roasted sweet corn? One piece of coconut? I did not buy these. Look at baby, he knows what happened. No, you didn't, cries Mrs. Addy, the banana seller, and Mrs. Femi, the orange seller, and Mr. Momo, the chinchin seller, and Mrs. Kunli, the sweet corn seller, and Mrs. Deli, the coconut seller. We gave those things to baby. Mama looks at baby. Baby laughs. Mama laughs too. What a good baby, she said. You put all those things straight into the basket. Mama rides a taxi. Baby goes to sleep. Poor baby, said Mama. He's not had one single thing to eat. The end. But did he actually have things to eat? Yes, he did. He's been eating all day. He had a banana and he had an orange and he had a biscuit and he had sweet corn and he had coconut. He had so many things to eat. Mama just didn't know. She thinks he's really hungry from not eating all day, huh? And that is the end of the story. And this story actually um, takes place in um, Nigeria. And that is where uh, this market is taking place. So it's kind of interesting that we can learn about a different place. Okay, friends, thanks for joining me for Baby Goes to Market, and I'll see you next time.